little spicy. It's a little spicy, a little spicy, baby. Lord. Okay, boom. <clears throat> What's up, two chefs? So, today we're doing something a little bit different. Y'all know I'm always all about like bringing you a recipe and showing you how to cook it and everything like that. But today, um, I've been challenged by the lovely Ginger Snap to complete the do not say mmm challenge. So, that means while I'm eating something I really, really like, I cannot describe it or emotionally connect to it by saying mmm like mm -mm, good y'all see i keep saying it right because it's gonna be a little bit hard for me i'm not good at this um so what i figured my my um logistical plan just to make sure i don't say it i'm gonna tell you guys a story while i eat just to give you guys a close up, I have green lip mussels as well as some king crab. Y'all know I got my sneaky sauce back here. It's the same sauce from the lobster video. I'll post it eventually. I did uh, record how to make it, but I felt like that was a lot for one video. Also have some limes here. Um, I know y'all see me wearing white back here, which is wild, so. I'm not going to say, mm, I'm also not going to get dirty. I'm supposed to be going over to my people's house for dinner tonight. Ain't trying to change. Well, I'll change if I have to, but I'm trying to get dirty. So I have to take a shower. You feel me? Y'all see that? This is from B Claws. I think I got a, it's a lobster. Look at lobster. One here. I'm even gonna get me some gloves because I know the moment I start getting on my hands, I'll be like, ooh, and it wouldn't be in reaction to the deliciousness of the food. It'd just be on me being extra the way I am. I got my siren girl here, just ice water today. Mm. And I'm hungry, so let's give glory to God. Thank you, God. I give you all the glory. And number two, let's sing our song. But we didn't cook it. Today we bought it. Kick off your shoes, it's a sushi chef beat. Gather around, cause it's time to eat. We bought it, we bought it. Now we'll eat it. Let's go, sushi chefs. So. I'm not gonna do well on this. I'm just letting y'all know right now. Starting off with that king crab. Still feel a little cold to me. It was in there for a while, but. No, it's good. While you guys are here, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. If you guys are liking the content, I see a lot of people really enjoyed my little lobster video. So I decided to go ahead and take my amazing mac and cheese video. Y'all, I know this was traditionally served as a side dish. Look at that. I could eat this all day. Just put this little banner above, it, above me and you'll be able to watch the mac and cheese video but um had such good response to the 12 lobster mukbang mukbang that i decided uh it should go up there so ain't much left in here <laughs> so go ahead and watch that if you are loving the content, please watch all my videos. They're all a little bit different. They got different vibes. But that's what we love about people, right? 
to be able to see the entirety of who they really are. And I'll tell y'all straight up, this YouTube thing ain't no facade. It's not a game. If you were to come out and kick it with me, IRL, in real life, you would be like, wow, you are crazy. Just like you are in your videos. I've been trying to tell you. My friends who watch this, and my, my husband always tells me, because I, I, I'll be honest, I do, I do say the craziest things to my husband. But for my friends who really know me, been around for a while, they know that I'm not all the way regular. So, just so y'all know, ain't no fake fake around here. Telling my story is really helping me because I love muscles. Y'all never see me eat them on this channel because I'll be way too into it. Be everywhere. I love mussels. I've been liking green lip mussels um, a little bit more lately, but I also like kind of like, I think the black ones are New Zealand mussels, I want to say. The black mussels I think are super delicious as well. Who the spicy? It's a little spicy, a little spicy baby. Lord. Uh, I just came back from watching, um, I said, um, I didn't say the other word. I came back from, and that's actually a really good segue because I just came back from watching Steph and Tasha's No Habits video that they put out. It's a new challenge from Tay and Lou. If y'all don't know who Tay and Lou are, just here to the side of me will be a link to their channel so you can go watch them and subscribe and whatnot like that. They have a, uh, a, a what's it called? A no habits challenge where basically you, you can get people to tell you what your normal habits are in your video. And for the whole video while you are recording, it doesn't necessarily have to be a mukbang or anything like that or eating. It's my lime juice. It's my first time having lime juice on King Crab ever. <laughs> I'm glad this isn't the don't like your mouth challenge. Anyway, that is so good. <laughs> I keep like concentrating really, really hard when I'm eating. Like that first bite, that's the bite that'll get you. That first and second bite, that's when you're going to be likely to say it. It's so juicy. Mm. I told y'all. I'm gonna just stick to my story. Shoot. I didn't even watch all the details of it. I don't know if you're like automatically out when you say it. <laughs> Cause I didn't get that far. This would be a really short video. Anyway, I'm gonna keep telling my story. They have a no habits challenge where somebody gets to basically say what habits you normally have uh and they can tell you that you can't do two things while you're create while you're doing your video so it is for it is for uh content creators 
So, Tay, if you guys watch it, if you watch a couple videos, it's very addicting. They have a really fantastic channel. So, if you watch their channel, Tay, <laughs> Tay freaking loves food, y'all. And she loves it so much. Every single time she eats, she does this. <laughs> and she squeezes her eyes closed the whole time that she's eating. And then when she finally does open her eyes, she kind of opens them like this because it, it looks like she still wants to squeeze them closed. She said it make the food taste better. <laughs> I can't help but wonder if like she's always done that. Or if that's something she started doing or, or even just realized when she started doing YouTube. <laughs> it was very funny. It was very, very funny. And then Lou, she always licks her lips and like big lips. Not just like, mm, got a little bit of some right there. Like, mm, that's them. Like borderline, mm, what's going on? <laughs> My muscles. I don't know, y'all. I'm gonna have to find a different place. I made the king crab today. Like, I did that here at the house. But I don't know if it's just me and in my area, but I can never find green lip mussels like at the store. I feel like they don't only sell them. At restaurants, there's like two restaurants. So, whenever I have green nut mussels, I like purchase them and get them delivered to me on Uber Eats. So I ain't going all the way out there. It's not even all the way out there. It's like a 25 minute drive. For me to go out there and try to find parking or Risk my life, because that's in the ghetto. This is in the ghetto. I don't know if they have any Maryland fans out here that's watching. But b Claws, if y'all know where b Claws is. Ooh, it's ghetto over there. I'm just saying, be honest. My sauce is very good. I really should put the recipe up. It just coats everything. throwing it out there. I like king crab because if you know what you're doing, you get all of the meat out like in just a few snaps. But, oh lord. I'm getting full. Uh, back to my story. Tay always closes her eyes really tight and Lou always licks her lips. And so, Steph and Tasha responded to the challenge, and they did their own thing, and they basically did a don't wipe your, don't wipe anything. Tasha couldn't wipe her mouth, she couldn't wipe her hands, she couldn't use a napkin or nothing, like she can't wipe. Oh, no. Yeah, Tasha couldn't wipe anything. With anything. I think Steph... She couldn't use a napkin, but she could use her hands. And then they both couldn't say the word that I can't say. So it's interesting how like these challenges sometimes uh, like overlap each other. I think it's really cool. So if y'all are still here hanging out with me, go ahead and tell me if, if you've been watching my videos, right? Like you can't really say I can't really, it's not going to be as good if you just base it off of one. So go back and watch some of my videos if you haven't. And uh, take a look and see what some of my habits might be. You know what I'm saying? And I talk a lot. Like, I really talk a lot. But go back and watch some of my videos right now if you guys have a, like a lazy a lazy Sunday or something like that. And let me know 
what you think some of my habits are because I want to do I want to do that the no habits challenge this week because I already failed this one but the way that they did it with the no habits challenge was by points and they kind of competed with each other because there was two of them and for each for each time they did it they would lose five points and then at the end of it they would see like you know who won between them and it was all bragging rights i guess but you could lift you could uh elevate the wager you could certainly do that we tried we're almost at 500 subscribers y'all we're gonna have us a little party I'm going to be doing a really nice giveaway once we hit 500 subscribers. So if you have friends out there who aren't subscribed, maybe they already watch, because that's kind of the thing I've been seeing. I still have a lot of people who watch my videos, like consistently watch my videos that aren't yet subscribed. So once we hit 500, I will be definitely doing like a celebratory mukbang. Maybe I'll do my mac and cheese or something. Y'all tell me what y'all want to see. So let's get to 500. We can be 500 sub buddies strong here together. 500 sous chefs in the building, the sous chef family. Hmm. Just did it again. Oops, I said mm again. I lost the challenge. I'm not that good at it. But for all, I'm done, y'all. So I'm gonna eat these last little bits, little king crabbies. I'm not gonna clean up. I'm gonna take a nap. Because it's Sunday. And Sunday is made for resting. While you're here, I just want to ask you two things. If you've made it this far, please make sure that you give my video a thumbs up. That you leave me some really great feedback in that comment section. And that you tell your friends to subscribe. Because once I get to 500 subscribers, I'm telling you, the giveaway is going to be amazing. And if you want to be part of it, help help us reach our goals, y'all. We're trying to hit 500. That's our next most immediate goal. We'll celebrate again at 7:50, and then when we hit 1K, I'm just I'm just gonna give y'all everything. I'm gonna give y'all everything. And last but certainly not least, remember that even though we didn't prepare a recipe here today. That saying that we say every day at the end of our videos about you can make it yourself. It doesn't just apply to recipes. It doesn't just apply to food. It applies to every area of our life. You know, sometimes we have dreams and ambitions and goals of things that we want to do and be. And sometimes it's just a really good reminder that you can make it yourself. You can get there. You can do it. You can be every single thing that you want to be. Not like you do it by yourself but you too can make it. So that's just a little reminder that you can make it yourself. And I hope you guys have an amazing week. I'll see you guys on Tuesday actually. So you won't have to wait so long for me this time around. And um, I'll see you then. Love you guys. Y'all know, I just did that whole challenge about not saying, mm, and I sat down to sit here and just review and make sure I even did it right, and I didn't, but I also realized I didn't challenge anybody, so this is me throwing out my challenge. I challenge Miss Rhonda's Red Sauce, I challenge the Sea Circle, and I also challenge Simply Shakita. I'm going to put all their links down here in the description box. And y'all go check them out as they do this challenge. It's time to get it in. Love you guys. Don't forget that you can still make it yourself. Okay?